Hi, I'm Emma Carpenter. I'm a Division I golfer, and today I'm gonna play three holes on the new Golf Zone Wave simulator and launch monitor. And I'm gonna show you some tips and tricks along the way. The Wave is a versatile simulator and launch monitor. It can be used indoors and outdoors, easily packs away in my golf bag, and is the perfect solution to dial in my game. The new Golf Zone Vision Wave software has over 100 courses. You can compete with others and play full 18 holes tee to green. What you're about to see is exactly how the Wave would look and feel as if you were playing it at home. So come with me to play holes 16, 17, 18 on the ocean course at Kiwa Island. So the 16th hole in the ocean course at Kiwa Island is a par five. I'm playing at 488 yards. So let's see if I can get this first shot in the fairway. All right, so didn't catch it perfect, but right down the middle, we'll take that every time. I got about 268 left, so I'm gonna hit about a seven iron and leave myself about 100 yards here on the layup. Go! No! <laughs> All right, looks like we needed a few more yards, just ended up right there on the lip of the bunker. Um, I've got about 112 left to the flag, so I'm gonna grab a gap wedge and hopefully hit a good one in there. I've got a 32 footer for birdie and it's giving it's saying it's breaking a little bit right to left so I can put my ball down, aim a little bit to the right and hopefully give it a good run. Now I'm really excited about this putting mat. It's really what separates the wave from all other launch monitors. Oh geez, so close. All right, so I love myself about two feet. Tap and par, we can never complain about that. So 17th hole, par three, I got 169 yards to a back right flag. Golf Zone says it's about 150 yards to the front edge, so I'm gonna hit a seven iron in there and try to hit a good one. All right, so pretty good shot there into the 17th hole on the ocean course. We got about 15 feet left, um, and it's a pretty straight putt here, so I'm really gonna try to give this one a good run for birdie. Get there, yes! Woo, yes! Birdie on 17 on the ocean course. We love that, we love that, that's huge. <laughs> All right, so final hole, 18th hole here on the ocean course. We got about 388 yards to the hole and it's a little bit of a dog leg right, so I'm gonna try to hit one up the left and set myself up for a good second shot. Hang on. Oh, shoot. All right, so ended up in the left rough here. Got 203 yards left to the flag. Got a lot of wind in my face, so I'm gonna try to get there with a three wood. Hopefully I can get it up on the green and still have a putt. Keep going, keep going. It's just one of those holes today. Can't catch a break on this one. I've got now a 38 yard bunker shot, so hopefully I can just kind of get this one out there and give myself a putt for par. Sit, sit. Not a terrible shot from that spot. I got about 24 feet left for my par, so if I could sink this one, that would be an epic way to close out the day. Oh my gosh, do it. No way! <laughs> All right, so super pumped about that finish there on 18. It was a downhill right to left breaking 24 footer. So I was extremely impressed with the way the wave and putting mat was able to tell me where to aim and how to get that putt done. I play competitive golf year round and I was definitely very impressed with how accurate this technology is in distance, aim, and chipping and putting around the green. So it would be a great way to learn how to play golf, to 
practice your game and to compete with friends. It's so portable, it can fit right in my golf bag and I can take it to the driving range, I can set it up at home. It really is the next closest thing to being right on the golf course. With the Golf Zone Wave, I can really play anywhere, anytime. If you're an avid golfer like me and you want to learn more about the new Golf Zone Wave, head to golfzonegolf.com slash wave.